All right, let's see if we can get this thing to move. Let's see, on switch, little choke. That's good. Let's see if we can get the hose down here. It's always nerve-wracking moving a 1,300-foot system. came off what does that mean uh oh oh uh, I don't really like what that means it means I got to go find the link and then oh this may be the link right here Okay, well, I guess I get to go find that piece and figure out what we're doing. I also think I may need to go find a spare chain in case we have a problem. Okay. All right, up to the top. Oh, ran over a railroad tie. So we get to put our lovely opener on. Oh, I gotta go get the clamp for it. Put this guy on. And then we gotta go get this clamp on. Which way does that wanna flow? So we want to turn this so we don't kink it. There we go. All right, let me go grab the clamp, which I think is by one of these risers up here. I did exactly what I said I wasn't going to do and leave this stuff out because I don't want to have to go find it. But I didn't listen to myself. Thank you. 
valve. Get absolutely soaking wet and open this valve. I really hate this part. Um, I guess I could go get a uh, rain jacket, but what fun is that? Oh, golly. Did I just break it? Probably. Oh, yep. Dang it. All right, false alarm. We need to go fix the opener. This piece in here broke. This piece in here broke. I gotta take it back up. Gotta, gotta do some surgery on it. All right, so here's what I did for the, the surgery. I took and I welded this piece on, and then I just stuck a bolt through here. I was gonna weld this handle to here, but I decided if I need to get back into this, I need to be able to take it apart. So let's try this again. We're gonna put this guy on, and then clamp on. Do my flick sheet. And we're gonna put this on because I'm gonna get absolutely soaking wet. I already know it. pipe wrench to turn this guy because he is stuck on there pretty good. Alright, well back up to the top. Alright, so here we go for the third time. This time I'm going to open it. Oh just a touch with this guy. Alright. Now we should get it. I clued the top of the handle with a bunch of heavy duty wire. Oh, we'll see what happens. All right, do that. Let's open this. inner tube sealed it so that's good all right let's go down to the flap of the pivot let's turn that off we've got water zooming its way down we got the other end opened let's straighten this guy out Whew. forgot how heavy these are 
move this line over. All right, that water is already zooming all the way down there. So let's go help it out. Let's go turn the pivot off. So to push water back up to the side roll, we got to turn this valve here, which I can't do one handed. If you haven't seen the re valve replacement, let's see. You can go back to a couple other videos and you'll see how I replace this valve. It was quite a quite an endeavor. But this basically cuts water off to the pivot and pushes it up towards the side roll. Something like that. And then, ugh, another project is to come and put an actual gate and all that stuff in here. But not today. Now we gotta come over here. Hey, baby. Ugh. And turn the pivot off. We don't need him going around in circles with no water. All right, let's go back up and see if we got water at the other end. Well, that didn't take very long to get water down here, so that's good. So we gotta close this up and see if we can build up some pressure. Oh, my feet are gonna get wet. I gotta get some boots. Boy, that's good clean water. There we go. Ah! I may need to put a, once we drain it, go and put a, uh, ugh, a ouch, put a different seal in it. So now the pressure is gonna work back up the line and uh, do its thing. Hopefully, that's what we want. I will probably have to come down, excuse me, I will have to come down and unclog it because it takes a little bit, you know, it gets all that junk in there. Ugh. But it takes a little bit to, to repressurize. And so we'll just wait a minute, let it do its thing, and then we'll come back maybe in about 20 minutes or so. Well, we got the side roll up and running. It's doing okay, but it needs a little more water. So we're gonna go turn that other pump on and give it a little boost. But it's much improved from uh, when we started this uh, last year. Actually, I've decided to wait to go turn that other pump on because this thing is still in the process of pressurizing. I'm pretty sure though that it's not supposed to work like that. So I gotta go fix that. But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Hope you all enjoyed. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you guys on the next one. Have a great day.